we will start with the hands on session on creating 3d pipe geometry and the mesh in open foam so over to abhishek so now the next hands on session using spoken tutorial is going to be on creating 3d pipe geometry and then mesh it so till now the geometry that you have mesh is a square rectangle geometry now you are going to mesh a circular or a pipe geometry like a circular prism that's it i'm going to provide the link for that now i hope uh, all of you have received the link and you just have to follow this tutorial the procedure for following this tutorial is same as before and if you have any problem just type your error whatever error you receive in the chat and we will solve it sir in my cavity folder there is no cavity pipe uh, folder is there only cavity clipped cavity and cavity grid so i think you missed a space after two cavities there is a space is that so you found no sir i have written a uh, cavity only and it is okay. showing okay can you just paste the command that you used to copy in the chat box so turn me i think you typed the command mistake instead of icoform there is incoform that is a mistake incoform one minute that was for tanmay by the way if you are having trouble copying it uh, binayak had just pasted the command to copy so that you guys don't have to make any trouble figuring out where the mistake is but sir in my ecoform uh, solver there is cavity but in cavity folder there is no cavity pipe folder only three type of folder in yeah as i'm saying uh there is no cavity pipe but there is a cavity and at the very end there is a space between cavity and pipe i think you missed the space okay sir i am trying just copy the command that binayak uh, has given okay hi ashwin i am joseph actually um for in open form i am using open form 9 actually so in my eco form cavity pipe is not there uh okay you are using open form 9 i see yeah. that uh inside cavity this would be an another cavity file right uh, i insert cavity there is cavity yeah. and then there are other cavities okay you just copying that cavity file and you are renaming renaming it as pipe pipe that's all okay, okay yeah so there is a space between cavity and pipe ah uh, yeah got it got it okay fine okay hmm. people who have completed the tutorial can raise their hand hello sir yes uh, sir actually uh, i am getting same issues there is no pipe in cavity okay uh never mind uh, people who have completed very good and even if you have not completed i'm going to show you how to do it now so you can just follow me i'm going to be very brief so many people i think have trouble copying the file right so let's see i am using open form 9 and this box in open form 7 8 9 uh so when i do cp minus r and i'm going to do form tutorial See, I'm not going to type whole tutorial. I'm only going to type T U. Then I'm going to press tab, my tab. So what it does, it, it automatically completes the sentence or uh, the command. So when I press tab, see, it automatically completed it. So I'm going to press slash, then I N C. Then again, I'm going to press tab. It will automatically complete it. Uh, if you do this, uh, you'll know that you are not making any spelling mistake. if you were to make any spelling mistake then the, com the when you press the tab it won't complete itself so i'm going to press ic and when i press tab it is completing my echo form again ca then tab then cavity again ca then tab then cavity so i think here many people have made mistake because after this last cavity there is a space p i p a so in previous tutorial what you guys used to do was you would put here dot and this dot represented current directory now instead of dot if i put pipe 
then it is going to copy this cavity file but after copying it is going to re rename it as pipe so now if i press enter and do ls i will have a file name pipe got it i think this is the mistake uh, that those guys uh, who were having trouble or said that cavity pipe is not found they had this yes, problem actually uh, okay uh, we need to copy and replicate cavity as pipe yeah as a pipe that was the thing yeah. okay okay actually we thought already in uh, tutorial itself cavity yeah. pipe is there that's okay it. okay now i'm going to go to my pipe and what i'm going to do is i'm going to mb mb stands for move so i'm just going to rename my zero zero pipe because if it is there then it may create some problem that's why right. while opening paraview so i just re ah oh, sorry oh i'm already inside pipe so i don't need to do uh do pipe i think most people also did the same mistake just right uh what i did so i'm already inside pipe this is why i don't need to give this pipe here so what i'm going to do mb zero and then zero dot origin so this should rename my ls see previously it was zero now it is zero dot origin it has changed its name now i'm going to type uh, open my block list i'm going to use notepad for that and i'm going to press enter so i have already downloaded uh here the pipe and i'm going to copy all this so this notepad file where we'll get this pipe notepad file so this notepad file you can get at your uh, spoken tutorial website okay so so here and this spoken tutorial website if you click here the code file will download okay okay fine okay okay fine yeah. okay so where was i uh, i just copied it right and i had a notepad okay this is my block list dict i'm going to copy my pipe i just copied it and here from here i'm going to i'm going to paste it and i'm going to save it so what are these vertices and how what are these blocks and edges uh, you can refer to spoken tutorial for that i'm going to close this thing and now when i do block miss my block miss is done now let's see the result again same procedure to see the result touch result dot form now if i do ls it will create a result dot form file in my uh, folder i'm going to open my folder using explorer.exe then dot now i'll view it okay this is my pipe uh so this is just a pipe but uh you are not able to see the message to see the message go here in this surface click here and select surface with edges now you can see the geometry how the division is done this time this is a 3d geometry which is why you are getting mess in the, even in the z direction you can see the division in the mess and this is the x and y yeah you can see the how the circular mess is being done i think we have how many blocks five blocks right one then we have one block over here so we have four blocks for the periphery and one block over here uh if you want to visualize the block you can do so by using para form dash block this may or may not work on your wsl because this requires a uh, graphical interference to be enabled so if you if you have windows 11 this will work so when i click on apply so this is the block that was used so as you can see there there are five blocks this is the first block and 1 2 3 4 and these are the vertices that was used in the block miss file so we have come to the end of this tutorial and so even if you guys some some of you guys may have problem you can again go to the same spoken tutorial website and then do it in your leisure time and if you have problem you can write us to our mail 
will be happy to solve your problem.